What's going on guys? Today, Sadie, my cousin, who is 10 years old, I think maybe nine when filmed, I actually don't know, is going to learn how to do a fakie big spin. And this was originally meant for the Braille channel, but it just never fit into uh, the Braille schedule. So it's going on my channel and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go subscribe to my channel. You probably already have subscribed to the Braille channel. So go leave a like, comment, and uh, I'd like to continue this series on my channel. So if you have any tricks for Sadie to learn, Leave it in the comments below and uh, enjoy the video. What's up guys? I'm here with my cousin Sadie. She is 10 years old and she rips. And today we're gonna teach her how to do a fakie big spin. Sadie, have you ever done a fakie big spin? All right, so she's never done one. And I don't know, have you done a half cab? Yeah. So she's done a half cab. And uh, I think we're gonna warm up, do every basic trick you can do. And then we're just gonna get right into the, half uh, the fakie big spin and uh, take it from there. And for everybody who doesn't know, a fakie big spin is when you go fakie and you do a 360 shove it with your board and you turn 180. All right, yeah, let's take it through SMS. Ollie, front 180, back 180, shove. All right. Ooh. Good stuff. Oh yeah, back when it, it's coming. Woo. Pivot, Aaron Cairo pivot. Woo! Oh, let's get a rebate. Yeah. You wanna do the pop shove and front shove? Okay. Yeah. Is that first try? Oh! Front shove! What's up? I know you can do it, like, put your front foot like that and put your back foot more in the pocket. They're like opposite, you gotta go like that. Oh, heads up! Oh yeah, that front foot catch! All right, Sadie, so you basically went through all your basic tricks on flat ground. How did you learn all these tricks? I learned the ollie from my dad and Kelly. So, how did you learn how to shove it? I just had my 180s down pretty well. And then, um, I first just learned by just doing one foot, like. <laughs> yeah, I understand, like a one foot practice step. And then I um, just started committing and I actually, and I learned it and well, we were on a vacation and then I was just really practicing to commit and I finally just jumped high and just landed. How did you learn front and back 180s? Like what was the key to those tricks? The key was to move your body. Like rotate your shoulders yeah. all the yeah, way? you could like, you get um, like that and then twist and do the 180. Or Perfect. Like, Front 180, and that also a tip for front 180s is you put your foot like there, in, uh, with your toe off, and this foot back here, and then it catches it when you bring around. Oh, very nice. And I think in the beginning when Sadie first started skating, she was skating a huge board, a huge board, and it was hard for her to do like a lot of tricks. And when she decided to go not as big, like a uh, what do you, what size board do you ride right now? I think it's like seven three. Seven three. See, like she has to ride a small board because obviously she's not big enough yet for like a big eight two five or something. And I think a small board helps her flip the board a little bit more and uh, be able to have more board control. So, do you want to try this fakey big spin or you want to do a half cab first? Just try. It. You want to just go for it? All right. I'm gonna explain what the fakey big spin is and just show you guys what it is. So basically, the fakey big spin is again a three shove fakey and a 180 turn. Oh! Ah. Okay. You got the idea. I'm not very good at fakey big spins. But we're going to teach Sadie how to do it anyway. You want to just try it? Okay. <laughs> Sadie, I think that you were going for a full cab there. That was it. I mean, you got the rotation already. It's just now it's a matter of getting your feet on there and rolling away. You want to try to do a fakey shove it first? Okay. 
There we go. Count it. You just gotta turn your body more. See right now it looks like you're kinda going fakey and you're just doing a three shove. You just gotta make sure you turn your body with the board. So when you're going backwards, you're gonna wanna go like this, wind up, and then turn with it. <laughs> you gotta you gotta turn a little bit more. Going for the fakey three shove. I mean that'd be cool too. When you're going fakey, put your shoulders this way and then wind up and go. You wanna turn this way. So like if you're right coming fakey right here, you wanna turn that way. Alright? Alright, take it down. Let's do a couple half cabs. So a half cab is basically when you do a fakey 180 and it's backside. So uh, I'll show you one. So you got that. So all you have to do now is basically just put a little 360 shove in there. So you got it. Right here. Oh, the other way, Sadie. So to me, I can see what you're doing wrong. And I think you're just not turning your shoulders enough. You're getting the rotation, but you really need to turn your shoulders more. Because when you're doing it, you land kind of still this way. When you should have already turned your back. So I think I want you to focus on just turning your body these next tries. So do you think that's one of your problems or? Yeah. I'm gonna do it switch, but I don't know if I can land it. But I'm gonna just show her since she's regular too. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, half full cab. Oh, sorry. Let's take it to the grass real quick. So basically what you wanna do, you're going like this, you're doing a full cab. You're going full cab right there, but that was a 540. Kind of doing a three shove, or you're doing a full cab. And what you really just need to do is do a little bit of both. You can't 360 your body. You got to only 180, but you got to 360 the board. So you just gotta turn it. Let's see you try, try a couple in the in the grass. Yeah, you see, your your front, you're, you're going like this, Sadie. You keep going like this. You keep turning the wrong way. Yes, that was it. You want to put your arms over here, turn all the way this way. Okay? You're going like this. You're going like this to get the rotation, but then you're going like this way. For some reason, I don't know why. So you just got to turn it like that. You're going the wrong way. That, actually, that one you probably would have landed on the concrete. So let's, Let's take it back to the concrete. Oh! That was it. That's it. That last one you had it super perfect. Oh! See that one, Sadie? Your, your upper body just didn't move. You still gotta move your upper body. There it is. Oh! That was it. Right here. Right here. Hashtag find Sadie a sponsor. Right here, Sadie, get it. Oh, almost landed a three shove. Oh, so close. You land this and you got Lance in a game of skate right here. Oh my gosh, that was so close, you got it. Oh, you just gotta put your other foot on there. Wow, Sadie, right here, right here, and it's ice cream. My treat, my treat. I won't make you buy it this time. <laughs> oh! Lance just told me he ran into the exact same problem. So don't worry if it takes you a couple more tries, even the skate god has trouble with this one. Woo! All right, Sadie, should take a breather. Been going ham for the last, I don't know how many tries, but should I take a breather? Get all your energy together and just land this next one. All right, let's take it down. Oh, doggy! I know what you're doing wrong. It's not a big problem, but this is just the way you're gonna land it, is that every time you're doing it, you're getting the full rotation, but then you're putting your back foot off. 
And the reason that is, is because you're using so much effort to get it all the way around that you can't like keep your back foot in the air. So this time, I want you to put your feet a little bit closer together and that way you can flick it a little bit faster to get it all the way around. And uh, I think you can get your back foot on there easier. Try to land towards the nose of the board more because you keep landing towards the tail. Yeah, just turn those shoulders, get all the way around. That's it, see if you just turned a little bit more, you see how you're landing like this? You gotta land like all the way that way. Got it. <laughs> you were just off balance that one. So that was it, you're turning more, that's better. Oh, into the bowl. Let me drink water. All right, let's get a drink of water. She just got water, she's pumped, she's ready to go. I can see the fire in her eyes. Oh, so close. You tired? Don't worry. Just gotta land it and then you're done. <laughs> Think of it as like a fakey shove it, but you're just rotating your body a little bit. So just literally, because you can do a full rotation easily. Just do a shove and then just rotate a little bit more. If you can do a fakey shove and then just turn, if you can land that, it makes it so much like easier to like visualize. See, like if you had just landed that, that would have been basically the entire trick. Right there, you see Sadie? You had that. So just do it like a, sh a fakey shove, but just rotate a little bit more. Oh! Oh! We got 50 year old who can kick flip over here. We got the water boy. Man, you're landing a fakie three shove. Oh. oh, Sadie, that was it. You did it. You see how you landed like this though? So you just gotta really turn it all the way. Oh, you land right in the middle again. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, Sadie. Just think in your mind, if I land this next one, all the pain is over with and it's all been worth it. Oh, you have it. Try putting your back foot with the toes a little bit more over the edge. Just get that faster rotation. Oh, my God. I want you to land it like this and just ride away and it'll be the coolest fakie big spin ever. Ugh. Don't get too angry on yourself. This is a hard trick. Okay, I can see yourself, you're getting mad and frustrated, but it is, like, this is like how skateboarding is. You just gotta stay positive and know, like, once you land it, it's the best feeling in the world, so. Take as many as you need. Oh, board! Oh my gosh, that was it! Oh! Get it right here, Sadie! Oh, so close! Oh. <laughs> oh, you got it. You got it down now. Take it down. Yeah! Yeah, Sadie. Good determination. That was a battle. That was a gnarly battle. She took slam after slam and it is so hot out here. Limited supply of water. <laughs> I mean, it was really gnarly. Like I've seen Sadie land a lot of tricks, but this was definitely one of the harder tricks she had to land. And she took it down like what a boss. Talking? What were the struggles and like how did you eventually land it? It was because what you said, because I was turn I was focusing on turning the board 360 degrees that I couldn't turn my body. So do you have any advice for anybody out there? Like, like do they just have to stay positive? What, what do they need to do? Uh, stay positive and don't do what I did and just focus on what you're supposed, the board is supposed to do. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this episode of Sadie's series. Uh, please subscribe to the Braille channel, like this video. Check out Skateboarding Made Simple if you wanna learn any of these tricks. If you wanna see more skating of Sadie, I have some more on my channel, link will be in the description. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much, peace.